Hey everybody, welcome to part 9 of Ratchet Deadlock. So, today we'll be going to the Valix Belt. Ratchet, you have now unlocked the Woo! Valix Belt campaign. Yeah, I know. Okay, so keep 5 enemies brainwashed at the same time using the brainwash mod. Scorpion Foil to kill 50 enemies. Strikers with the range. Strikers with the wrench. Although taking damage. Fusion Rifle. Pincer Rays using the hover ship. Complete any challenge without using health crates. Killed nine enemies with three different mods in 30 seconds. Mini turret launcher. Um, freeze mod to kill 20 enemies in a row. So pretty much what we're looking at is... Okay, actually, before we do that... Um, okay, we can configure it here as well. We need to take... Where's our sniper? Here it is. We need to take that off because to kill the two enemies in a row, you need to make sure you don't have any mods on. For some reason, that's very buggy, and I don't exactly know why. It just is and is super annoying. Well, at least we're here. Today from the Valix Asteroid Belt, home of the legendary Gamma Energy Beam. This the Gamma Energy Beam. Okay, anything new? There's the brainwash mod, so... My screen shows a hover ship inside the hangar bay. So we're gonna use this one. Oh, we actually gotta use the grind rail again. And again. Oh, you just ruined everything, fool. Stinking enemy. There you go. Please don't have another just random dropship right there. Alright. Spot him above me. That's at least a little better. Really, another one of. another big enemy. And we almost got this to V5. Okay, remember, don't use don't use the vipers. Ow! Can you not hit me? You hit me again, and I didn't do anything about it either. Impact mod. Almost does a thousand damage. Woo! What a chilly reception. Hey, swarmers. Chill out. Done. I don't even know how I hit him. I really don't. As for the health crate one, I know exactly which challenge to get that on, so don't worry about it right now. Medieval power. Now I believe... Medieval power is use the scorpion flail to kill 50 enemies. Perfect. I don't get why that one's worth so much. And then chill it. Use the freeze mod to kill 20 enemies in a row. Cycloids with the same weapon. So we'll just continue to try and use the Scorpion Flail. Cycloids, I believe, are those, those spinny looking enemies. Man, dropping so many enemies. It's absolutely crazy. Oh, apparently I missed out on this guy being back here. I don't believe this campaign is actually very long. These next two planets are fairly short, if I'm not mistaken. There's a hover ship in that hangar! Let's hit the sky, sir! Oh, apparently it only takes two hits to kill ships now. Wasn't there something for destroying five of them? I'm picking that note that's the hangar. That's great! There we go. Hey dudes. Now let's do this. I'm pretty sure the challenge will be done once this happens. Yeah, because the hover ship gets unlocked. And we only got two, so boo. Space Ace, destroy all the enemies. All enemies before he can land. I believe the skill point is for killing these things. But it's just like kill them, not have to destroy them all at the same time, you know? 
Hey guys, me to my hover ship of death. I like this hover ship in this game. It looks cooler than the one in, in uh, Upper Arsenal. I feel like some of the things in Upper Arsenal weren't as well designed as other games. Boom. Though I love a lot of the weapons in Upper Arsenal, like the Rift Inducer and all those shenanigans. Those things are absolutely amazing. But now they're absolutely amazing. Ah, see what I did there, guys? I know that was a bad joke. I apologize. Yeah, see, we're gonna get that no, don't use health crates thing here because clearly we're not ratchet right now. We're just a uh, hover ship. Decimate the horde. The horde, the robots. Yay! I don't know what else to talk about while doing this. What do you guys think of outer space? I absolutely love outer space. I think it's one of the coolest concepts for anything ever. Death to all of you! Don't, don't, don't you dare hurt me. Little guys. And there we go. School, 3400 volts. Like, I know you can only do it in this challenge, but... Doesn't that seem a little, uh... Awesome? These things are worth the bolt, so I do recommend destroying them. We're fighting over shampoo, apparently. That makes sense, right? Hey guys, how you guys doing? Uh, I guess I'm not close enough. There we go. This one takes a little bit of time, but it's really easy. Like I, we've barely taken any damage, and that's just me being stupid every now and then, you know, literally running into stuff. That one guy went flying, poor dude. Oh, I, I got too close to the other group of enemies. Why do you care about airbags? You're a robot. Oh my god, you guys actually say stuff in this one? Man, like we had you guys saying repetitive stuff over and over and now all of a sudden. And here I thought we were looking at a half day, Juanita. Juanita. Power up, hack the power station or Ratchet's objective is to power up. I don't want that. Okay, so let's see what else we get. The disease, don't have that yet. Three range strikers. What are range strikers? Without taking damage. Fusion rifle. Control lighthouse. But first, you'll need to All activate right. power stations at the north and south ends of the asteroid ring. Okay, apparently that didn't work there either. It was like clearly kill two enemies in a, in one shot with the fusion rifle, but okay. Yeah, see, there's one of those finicky Ratchet, ones. You are currently in a south power station. You must locate four power orbs. Have the orbs to power up the station. Hey there, man. How you guys doing? At least now we can one-shot these guys. Dude. Dude, are you gonna hack them or not? I don't see what the issue is. Ah, oh, just little guys. Well then, do them. Actually, I want to know what the enemy out here is. Is it a dropship? Oh, it's uh, one of the strikers or whatever they are. Just randomly dead down there. Well, not dead, stuck. Go destroy you guys before I guess we get to the turrets. Cause you know how annoying that is. You guys have watched mo most of my uh, tools of destruction let's play. You guys know how annoying those guys can get. Ugh. Boink. Hey, look, the ending's over there. Ah, uh, there are the two 
security orbs. Hack them, and you will have the North Power Station up and running. Okay, sounds easy enough. Should have got the skill point there, but nope, we didn't. That was it. Okay, uh, Arbiter time, which is supposed to level up anyway. Yes! Ammo mod! And a thousand damage. It does the most out of any weapon, yet... It feels like... Oh, goddammit. I don't have enough ammo. And you also don't have enough ammo anymore. Um, that's cool vipers. Yeah, invulnerable. We're invincible. Beautiful. Let the light shine okay, through. Turn bolt now. at station. To the second reflector and reactivate the gamma energy beam. Okay. In a row. In a row now works. Well, that's good to know. <laughs> we actually got it. <laughs> like I already have the platinum trophy for this game, so that's why you guys aren't seeing me get trophies. Like, it took a few playthroughs, but I got it all. As for you, I'm just gonna use a different- actually. Mini turret launcher, go! Shoot him! Oh, morphing mod. Don't know if I necessarily like that setup, though. I need to destroy one more after this, apparently. Well, that's gonna be easy. Grind rail, let's go. Actually, this campaign is longer than I thought. It actually surprisingly is. Well, these guys. Launchers, go! If I can have a loose yay! Point. I guess it's not gonna attack him. Well, let's go up. Guys, go up the elevator. I'm stuck on it. It's like a light bulb, but so much brighter. Oh, you words. Dude, it is a light bulb. It's a giant beacon. What do you think a beacon is? Might actually have to take the morphing mod off of, um... Off of our weapon, honestly. Don't think it's the best for that weapon. So you know what? I can do that right here. I always forget that that I can, you know. So I think. Oops. Why did you do that? On that. No. This is the one that I was going to put the morph mod on. Alright. Actually, you guys don't need to do that, but I accidentally clicked the shield link, so that's my fault. Okay. Let's use this now just to kill. Wow, it even levels up fast and. Ooh, ooh. I see you over there, fool. Do we have one more dropship, please? Thank you. Fuselage done. As well as the fact that we almost leveled up our uh, sniper rifle again. That'll be decent. Can we actually get it leveled up in this challenge? So we gotta go around here. 
Scorpion Flail! Why am I using Scorpion Flail? Point. Kill everything, little turret. Speed mod! Does that, the, does that mean it, it shoots faster or I can just launch him faster? That I'm not 100% sure of. Wow, this thing, this thing actually is pretty decent. Kill them all! Turret Syndrome! I get it, Tourette Syndrome. Bah! Nice one, game. There we go. Man, this mini turret launcher is actually decent. I actually enjoy it. Beside myself, and boy, do I look good. Campaign complete. We just might have a competitor. We unlocked a zero. We unlocked a zero, guys. Oh, it was gravity boots and a gold medal, but for some reason, it just said zero. Time extension. Yeah, so if you guys thought this was only uh, for the Puma, nope. I think this one may have a skill point in it. I believe it actually does. Most of them do. Surprisingly. Not. It's not very surprising. Also, if you didn't already get the no health crate one for some reason, then this is definitely another one you can get it on. Once again, kind of a joke, right? Yeah. I don't know, I used to love video games like this. These games were games that I used to think were worth buying, you know? A lot of modern games aren't. Like, before Honor, apparently, the multiplayer sucks on it right now, so it's not worth buying. It's, like, apparently very imbalanced or something like that. And $80 for a game where its campaigns for its characters are, like, really short. Eh, I had a hard enough time buying Destiny again, and I absolutely love Destiny. And it's short, it's just because there's not much to do. Like, there is lots to do, but at the same time, for a game that expensive and had that many expansions, it's not that much. And ring my bell. That's what I was talking about. Beautiful. And now, your land is my land. Control nodes are under enemy command. Travel to each node and retake them to win. Doesn't sound too bad to me. I'm gonna use the mini turret launcher again, because this thing is badass. Aha! Hey, guys. Wanna use your weapon? Here you go. Oh yeah, and mini turret launcher V3 with the new ammo mod. It only goes up 10 damage though. Yeah, just way more than what you think would be in a normal 10 damage, right? There we go. You guys do that while my mini turrets do everything. Guys, hurry up, get over here. Fine. If you're gonna freaking not show up, robot. I don't know why, they get glitchy in these rooms. It's another one of the bugs in the game. Oh, hey there, guys. Point. Oh, these guys are worth so much experience. Actually, you know what? I really should use you a little more. Man, this does not level up fast whatsoever. Ugh. Well, I guess it does level up decently quick, it's just... Alright, out of ammo. Like, I, I won't use the mini turret too much, just because I know it's a good weapon. Can you stop dropping these big guys behind me? I know they're not difficult or anything, but still, you just keep dropping them behind me. I'll change the weather per uh, episode. So this weather was snowy, next episode we'll have something else. Yeah, it's not supposed to be snowy here. It's supposed to actually look like this. See? Apparently the snow turned off on me. <laughs> just by walking into the building. 
Makes sense to not have it in buildings, but it kind of ruins the awesome effect of it all. And there we go! That is this area completely done. We will come back and get all the skill points eventually, but not right now. So anyways, in the next episode we'll be doing Planet Torval. Locate the hidden ship and escape the planet before enemies can track you down and put you six feet under. See you guys next time.